Shipment issue, please get in touch with us through our customer care channel. Kung ikaw ay nagpapadala sa LBC, paminsan-minsan or regular, you have to know this. Ito po ay isa sa pinaka um, common na status ng ating mga parcel. Meron akong blog um, na tinuruan ko kayo kung paano mag-track at kung ano yung iba't ibang uh, status noon at kung anong gagawin. Ito po yung pinaka-general eh. Parang hindi siya ganun ka-clear kung ano talaga ang problema. And all you have to do is um, contact uh, the customer care channel. That's true. Ito po yung possible five reasons kung bakit ito ang nagiging status ng ating shipment. Una, um, posibleng late yung arrival niya dun sa warehouse kaya hindi na isama sa delivery for that day yung status na yun actually is like system generated kaya kahit hindi pa narating minsan sa warehouse if that is scheduled na darating that day sa warehouse nagiging ganun na ang status ready for deli delivery pero kung hindi siya umabot uh, na dalhin ng mga rider ang magiging status pa rin niya ay shipment issue Medyo walang ganong problema kasi the, the following day, that will still be delivered naman. Okay, that's the first reason. Second, possible possible reason bakit ito ang status. Uh, Pusibling nagka-damage. Alright? It could be dun pa lang sa warehouse or pusibling hindi na tinuloy ni rider yung delivery kasi nga may damage na or baka na, na, na busted siya or nabuksan yung shipment na yon. So again, you better call the customer care channel. That's important talaga. Okay, para alam natin kung anong dapat gawin. Next, pusibli namang na miss route yung ating shipment. Alright? So, nadidetect naman nila yan. Yan eh, pag na miss route yung shipment natin. Miss route, meaning nadala sa ibang lugar or sa ibang delivery hub or warehouse. So, it would take a long time kasi i-re-forward niyan sa tamang destination. So, medyo mas matagal ng konti ito. So, you really have to um, inform your receiver na posible ang matagalan because of that. So, yung issue na to, uh, yung number three na, ah, number four na yon kasama rin dito posible sa shipment issue na to. Alright? Hindi siya masyado kasing specific. Kaya gusto kong i-discuss sa inyo, I am telling you all of this kasi naranasan na namin to. Every time na may shipment issue, I have to call. Kahit alam ko na yung mga possible reasons, what if the reason kasi is something like yung na damage. Okay, number four, reason. Ito naman ay dun sa mga pick up. Alright? Yung uh, kukuhanin ng inyong receiver sa LBC. Kaya nagiging shipment issue ang ating status minsan is because baka 10 days na doon, ika 10 day na today or tomorrow, so they have to alert by the status na dapat pick up na. Otherwise, after 10 days kasi, or within 10 days, yung ika 10 day mismo, binabalik na yan sa taga nagpadala. Alright? Or sa sender. So, eto naman ay applicable doon sa mga ipipick up sa branch. Alright? So, isang reason yun, bakit shipment issue? And the last one, posibleng reason kung bakit shipment issue ang ating status ay yung area na yun ay out of delivery zone. ODZ. Z. ODZ. Sa ODZ pa lang, nakikita na yan dapat sa branch. Alright? Nadidetect na nila. So, hindi na nila i-accept kung madetect na ODZ or red zone. Pero bakit minsan na-accept? Kasi sa system nila, hindi talaga siya ODZ. Kaya lang, pagdating dun sa area na pagdideliveran, hindi talaga um, totally na out of delivery zone siya. Ito lang ang nagiging status because they have to make a schedule. Nabanggit ko na rin to sa dating vlog ko, isa schedule nila yung delivery dun sa area na yon. One thing, remote yung area and usually, yung mga riders natin, they have to wait other shipment para sabay-sabay na i-deliver dun sa isang area because uh, going to a very remote air area tapos isa lang ang dadalhin na parcel would be a lot of spending for the rider and would, you know, mean a lot of time then dun sa rider. So, ganun ang ginagawa ng LBC. So, yun yung mga reasons kung bakit uh, shipment issue ang ating status ng mga parcel. Again, shipment issue, please get in touch with us through our customer care channel. So, if you are, uh, if you encounter this status, go ahead and call. Ito yung mga 
um, hotline in Metro Manila and provincial areas. All right, that's all for today. Thank you so much. Sana may napulo tayo. You all have a great day. If you still are not part of our channel, please go ahead, click that subscribe button and that notification bell icon so you'll be updated. Have a good day.